on everybody out there this is popular stranger and we are back at you again today with another madden 24 ultimate team video in today's video we got episode number 46 of the no money spent squad series and my plan is all coming together now if you guys missed the last episode i highly encourage you to watch it so you know what i'm talking about but today on the no money spent squad is a great day for free cards we're going to start this episode out how we've been doing the last couple episodes with a collection of clips from our latest twitch stream which was this morning where we did grind out the no money spent squad and we made one pickup to the team all right ghosts of madden solos are done well at least we got to 120 stars so as we said in the last no money spent episode we are going to take keaton mitchell 93 speed budget running back and even though it's a downgrade, we're going to get rid of Cordero Patterson here and put Keaton Mitchell at halfback number one with that 93 speed. Maybe we, we add a new running back eventually, but for now we're going to take the coins and see if we can get the production out of Keaton Mitchell. I think he goes for like 270 or something like that. Oh no, he dropped in price since yesterday. All right, well, we'll sell him for 230, basically 200k there once we sell or once he sells after tax fourth down here we go 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 i'm just playing a bunch of hook curls i'm hoping that they do the job oh yeah we're good we're good we're good we're good bro what i just sold donovan darius because he didn't have pick artists and we picked up palomao because he does have pick artists for that same situation. Do we have to rage sell again? I don't know how I got that throw off, but it doesn't matter. Skirt. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. You got to quit after that, bro. You just got to quit after that one. A lot of you have asked to see gameplay with the No Money Spent Squad, and though I probably won't give you a full gameplay video, I mean, maybe we'll leave the door open for it. I will try to do better putting at least gameplay clips in these episodes. If you guys are enjoying them, let me know down below in the comment section. So we've been playing some really good Madden this week, especially and specifically on the No Money Spent account. I just want to show you here on Mutt Champs, and I never have made it a point to try to finish all 25 games, uh, but this week we are 15-3 and three on the No Money Spent squad, and if you take a look through the record, I know my face cam is blocking a little bit of it, but we have won nine games in a row, and I think 12 of my last 13. Now, with the 15 wins, that's one of the objectives or kind of like a milestone in the rewards for the comp pass, so I'm going to stop there because I will likely be on my main account for the next two days with a new promo dropping later this afternoon, but we did really good, been playing really good Madden right now, great record for no money spent considering it's not my goon squad, and because we've been so successful in Mutt Champs and grinding out the competitive pass, we have finally hit level 48, which gives us that free 92 overall Darnell Washington. Now that card is probably outdated to a lot of you, but for me, it's going to be an upgrade on the no money spent squad, and it's going to allow us to sell that 91 overall Dalton Kincaid. Now we have basically about a week left on on this comp pass i'm not really going to make it a priority to grind out this pass for the next week we have a house rules coming today with part two of campus heroes for the next week that's probably where i'm going to put my focus at least on the no money spent account uh as far as gameplay wise so we will probably miss out on some of these other rewards here including that level 53 double legend pack which isn't much to be missing at all but as you can see we got to 15 wins this week and we knocked out all of our other objectives i played a few solo battles i think i played three solo battle games this week that puts me now for the entire duration of this field pass up to 17 solo battle games so i played a lot of online games not many offline we have a lot of xp we're probably going to leave on the table by not playing over the next week but i'm pretty happy getting to level 48 so we could get this free 92 overall card and we will be showing you our updated roster very soon now one other thing we did in this video earlier is we replaced cordero patterson with keaton mitchell well that ended up being very timely as well because this morning EA announced that if you tune in to the MCS playoff event, which is going to be next week, I think it's January 10th, you're going to be able to earn a free 92 overall Jonathan Taylor. And I know a lot of people looked at the overall and thought this is a terrible card. And listen, it's not the greatest card in the world, but it's a free card. And on my no money spent squad, that decision I made to go with Keaton Mitchell for a little while seems like it's going to be good. Jonathan Taylor, 94 speed. I think they said he is going to have like 92 or 93 juke move and he also is going to get running back apprentice for one ap that 
that is the perfect running back for a no money spent squad in my opinion with the speed the juke and the ability that's all i really need i don't care about much else he does have very low catching so we may have to go with gift wrapped on our quarterback which we talked about yesterday is probably gonna end up being the free johnny manzel so we'll make some roster changes in this episode in a moment though we do have a few free packs to open up these pretty much all came from grinding through the competitive pass those solos for the the ghost fantasy pack and the zero chill field pass um so let's go through them here we got a red zone pack which when we open up the red zone pack is going to give us a red zone pack but then in that red zone pack we're hopefully going to get something good maybe a 91 right maybe we can get some 91s that are going to be going for a lot right now we get the goat kicker in jake elliott should have made the pro bowl we get an 82 zero chill card they kind of they kind of they got me there they trolled me on that one star elite pack i don't really remember what's supposed to be in here but we got a zero chill animation and we get yet another 82 an 88 and a 73 so this is all just going to be training at the end of the day and finally two 82 plus zero chill player packs can we get a 90 out of one of these we get yet another 82 and the second one are we going to get yet another 82 are we going to get a 90 let's find out we get another 82 no surprise there my binder is full of 82 overall zero chill cards and then we have the exclusive darnell washington i this card is kind of so old at this point i don't even really remember his attributes or his abilities so 91 speed six foot seven good route running good catching the run block at 80 actually isn't bad as well they're actually extremely similar cards he and dalton kincaid there except for darnell washington's taller uh route running is a little edge to kincaid and of course run block is but overall i mean this is a no-brainer we're gonna take the free bnd card and sell the 91 which should be up in value right now due to part two campus hero promo dropping later today now with campus heroes there is going to be a free and i kind of say it loosely because there is one token or sticker helmet sticker you need to earn by completing a set so we'll see how free it is but basically there's going to be a free 93 overall johnny manzel that we're going to put at qb number one and attribute wise if you compare him to andrew luck andrew luck is by far better but for me with season four upcoming and the playoff promo upcoming i think i can get by with johnny manzel and this free baker mayfield from the zero chill field pass for a week or two i rather take the coins from andrew luck right now and then kind of save those coins and wait for a bigger better promo with bigger and better players or a better quarterback that will come out in the foreseeable future there's also going to be a free 91 overall part of the campus hero promo and it features a right guard so we'll likely be able to get rid of uh, wyatt teller here and make an upgrade on the offensive line with that card but for now let's go ahead and get rid of andrew luck and we still have the dalton kincaid card to sell um so we are gonna have to play house rules and i thought about keeping andrew luck for the house rules portion and then selling him but i think i'm gonna sell him now and i'm gonna give this baker mayfield card a try just simply because he's free and if we're all being honest here the competition level on house rules sometimes is a lot easier than it is in head-to-head -head season mutt champs so i think i can do all right with the baker until we go ahead and get that manzel fully powered up and while with baker they recently corrected and added set feet lead to his card so that was a big reason why i'm not using the free michael vick nor was i using this card now that we have set feet lead and we can get gunslinger here that is going to give us a usable quarterback now the one problem we're going to run into is that that's a total of six ap right for those two abilities you only got seven on offense i pretty much need a slot apprentice and the only one i have right now is andre reed which is two ap so six plus two is eight i knew that because i'm good at math i also know that eight is a bigger number than seven and you're only allowed seven ap on offense so i have to go out there and get a wide receiver apprentice or i'm sorry a wide receiver that gets slot apprentice for one ap we might take a look at team of the week chris godwin i can't imagine his card's going to be very pricey maybe we go out and get zero chill aj brown which gets it for one ap i'm not sure the route that i'm going to take there so we're not going to make a decision right now but likely what we're going to do is sell the andre reed card as well and then use those coins plus all of the other coins that we have so we can get that one ap slot apprentice wide receiver and again you guys can leave your recommendations down below in the comment section if you'd like to uh, but we're going to go ahead and get rid of andre reed as well so he's gone we'll take him out of the lineup and for now i'm just going to throw i guess i'll just throw this free victor cruz in here off uh, for now but we'll have to get that player before we jump in 
into house rules. So here is a look at the team now. Again, it looks pretty bad. We've made some downgrades that to me in my brain are upgrades because we're getting coin back and I still think we have a lot of very usable players. Obviously, they've been usable because we went 15-3 and three in Mutt Champs even after making some of those downgrades. Still working on the zero chill field pass so we can get that free Tariq Woolen at a 93 overall. Obviously, the other option is we can take A.J. Brown from that pack now and maybe go out and buy a cornerback instead. So I got to weigh my options. I got to look at prices there. I want to see what the market does after Campus Hero content comes out. But I think, again, and I say this all the time at the end of episodes, I think we did pretty good today. We'll go ahead and sell these cards that we said we were going to sell. By the way, earlier in the video, we showed you the Cordero Patterson. He did end up selling. I'm really surprised that this Andre Reed ghosts for so much. 300k is a pretty good return on this one considering I don't remember. I'd have to go back and look, but I think I paid like maybe 350, 360 for this card that is almost a month old here now and I'm still getting 300k back from it. That is a huge huge W there. Andrew Luck, I know I paid about 450. He's gone down in price. This is actually a really good price if you're looking for a quarterback right now. I think he's the best in the game if you factor in the price. Cover athlete Lamar Jackson and refer Refrigerator Perry's LTD, definitely better cards, but also really, really expensive. So we're going to get back a good chunk of change there for Andrew Luck. And the last card we have to sell is this Dalton Kincaid, which I'm kind of hoping is up in price. Yeah, um, a little bit about, you know, I, I think last night 91s were going for roughly about 120K. They still seem to be right around that price range. I'll sell this one for 119, but we're easily going to be over a million coins now. Uh, we're at, yeah, we're at a million coins now with Andrew Luck and with Dalton Kincaid still waiting to sell uh, in some of those coins. Again, we're going to have to go out and buy a wide receiver, but W of an episode, W upgrades, W progress on this account. And I think the next episode, we'll be picking up that new wide receiver and getting into some house rules games and earning some free content from the Campus Hero promo. Thank you for watching this one. My name is Popular Stranger. I'm out. Peace.